opinion no na eye chechre for edema ndc eye fifi fia vi kwete wadi ya tuja sme magana for enye dr mamudu baumia ya watu franka adi ya ma mpp ni memo mwenye nu enida isan sene ibe bia ujeni wadani judas ya wano wane boso mwampadi ya kufuadu wa yi nama ya wano ensisebi wa debaya no wano waso ka abaini humbi nene waso wano ujina nchain diya ni penye debaya no ninyi nana wanyintu mu Chochua fwadema Andy Samanyokuo. Fifi kwete ni nisamu yu tujwa wabra. Andy Samanyokuo no friends and chochua fwenshi ya muu. Edu wanu di isamu. Enu wanu yye. Efa mampenia bedi echire. Yawo ya franka tu fwadema MPP ya Manyokuo. Dr. Mahamadu Bawo Mia. Nisamu wadi tujwa na uchu echire muno. E tujwa. Enu muu no ure fifi kwete. Echire muse. Dr. Bawo Mia. Achire se. Eba. Se ubia. Esese gana fweji ni dia. Enye. Wame mukura. Ya ensa senku. Beji na kura. Ebe pri tu mi. Chire se. Mampenia bedi echire. E kura tu mishu e gana fweni. E chene hun. E di free. Mampeni na nado dan kwa kufu wadu. Ya onene kwa na kura na hundi ya. Enye. Na onyu ubia. Gana fu ubi tu mi. Ajine diye. Edu wame yi. Ashe nensa. Nchimu wade ba yibi ni. Baumia demonstrate that he has a massive response deficit. Such a person does not have the character to lead our nation. If Dr. Baumia has shown that he can literally stab Nanaku Fuado in the back by way of running away from poor policies while taking credit for the good things done, who else is Dr. Baumia not able to betray and throw under the bus? Wansa chila ya mampeni na nado dan kwa kufuado Ayan wanaswa fuomu ene daimu Eno ure fifi kwiti Echile muse Enya diye bia edeni sa chila yi bia ebeba Wechile mua Mampeni ya bedi echile edena du disa mu etu jano Wechile muse wadi aswa fuo edu yunu Individi juma Nenso mampeni ya kufuado Aswa fuo wadi ba ye chile se Senye wondodu wanodu wa sonwa mamu fuo kane ekano Enya diya watesu Enti ene Dr. Mahmoudi ba umiadi enu ebo bra kura In an era Where the clamor for efficient governance And fiscal prudence Has never been louder the recent reshuffle by President Akufuado starkly reflects a government in disarray, obstinately disconnected from the realities of his people. Despite the vociferous appeals from Ghanaians, civil society, the clergy, academics, and think tanks to trim the bloated size of government, a glaring drain on our nation's scarce resources, this administration has once again turned a deaf ear. And remember, the vice president of this republic continues to be Dr. Mahmoud Bawiyan.